So what actually is analytics? It's the science of wisely acquiring meaningful results from the given data using various methods and technologies and by which a pattern of variation is observed. By studying this pattern, we can understand the future and predict the uncertainty that is related to business. Various sophisticated models and techniques are used like statistical, mathematical, and economical models. So how do you go about analytics? First, you gather data. For example, for a commercial entity, you collect data from enterprise, social media, internet forums, etc. Second, you club all the data together and consolidate and organize it in a form from which you can analyze through visualization, statistics, etc., which is the third step in the process. In the next slide, we will see the different stages of analytics. There are major four stages in any analytics work. The first stage is called descriptive analytics, where data or information is gathered and summarized. This stage usually caters to questions like, how many students dropped out last year? The next stage is called diagnostic analytics, where data is analyzed and insights are generated, which help in answering the questions in the first stage. Here the question that comes up will be, why has the dropout rate increased in the last one year? With the help of the analysis done in the previous two stages, the next stage tries to answer unforeseen phenomena, like which students are most likely to drop out. This stage is called predictive analytics. Finally, the last stage, known as prescriptive analytics, tries to analyze the type of action required to be taken to support or avoid the unforeseen phenomena predicted in the previous stage. In this scenario, prescriptive analytics has queries like, which students should I target to keep them from dropping out? Next, we will look at a list of a few popular tools used in analytics. These are some of the commonly used tools for analytical purpose to get meaningful results. R. Revolution R. R Studio. Tableau. SAP HANA, WACA, KXEN, SAS. Next, we will discuss the role of a data scientist.